Hebrew language television series have been a force to be reckoned with, leaving an indelible mark on both local and international audiences. In this exploration, we will embark on a journey through the top 10 Hebrew language TV serials that have captivated viewers with their compelling narratives, outstanding performances, and unique perspectives. These series not only demonstrate the vibrancy of Israeli television, but also offer a window into the rich culture, history, and contemporary issues of Israel and its people. Number 10. Valley of Tears Valley of Tears is an Israeli historical war drama, that revolves around the events of the Yom Kippur War, also known as the October War or the 1973 Arab-Israeli War. This war took place between Israel and a coalition of Arab states, led by Egypt and Syria. The series is set during the first few days of the Yom Kippur War, which began on October 6, 1973. It primarily focuses on the experiences of a group of Israeli soldiers, and civilians who find themselves caught up in the conflict. The title Valley of Tears refers to the real-life battle of Emek Harbachar. Valley of Tears, one of the pivotal battles of the war, which took place in the Golan Heights. Number 9, When Heroes Fly. When Heroes Fly is an Israeli series that was first released in 2018. When Heroes Fly is known for its intense and emotional storytelling, as well as its exploration of the enduring bonds of friendship and the psychological toll of military service. The story unfolds as the group of friends reunites in an attempt to rescue Ya'ele, who they believed had died during the mission in Colombia. As they journey deep into the Colombian jungle, they confront not only external threats, but also their own past traumas, complicated relationships, and unresolved issues. Number 8, Hit and Run. Hit and Run was created by Lee Oraz, who were also behind the popular Israeli series Fahuda. Hit and Run is a thriller drama that combines elements of action, mystery, and espionage. It is known for its fast-paced storytelling, suspenseful plot twists, and action sequences. The series follows the story of Segev Lai, played by Lee Oraz, a former Israeli soldier living a peaceful life in Tel Aviv with his wife, Danielle. But, Segev's life takes a dramatic turn when Daniel is killed in a hit-and-run accident. Segev becomes convinced that her death wasn't an accident, but rather a deliberate act of murder. He embarks on a dangerous journey to uncover the truth about what happened to his wife, delving into a web of secrets, conspiracies, and international intrigue. Number 7, Hostages. Hostage is a psychological crime thriller, that garnered international attention, and praise for its suspenseful storytelling and complex characters. The show was adapted for an international audience with the title Hostages, and was remade in several countries, including the United States. The series revolves around the character of Dr. Yael Dannon, who is a talented surgeon. Her family is taken hostage in her own home, and she is forced to sabotage an operation that she was scheduled to lead, leading to the death of the Prime Minister. Yael's husband, Yael Dannon, is a former military officer and becomes one of the hostages in their own home. Number 6, Our Boys. Our Boys is a drama series that premiered on HBO. It is based on real-life events, and explores the aftermath of the abduction and murder of three Israeli teenagers in 2014, which ultimately led to a series of violent events, and heightened tensions between Israelis and Palestinians. Their disappearance, and the subsequent discovery of their bodies in the West Bank, led to a significant escalation in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. The series delves into the emotional toll on the victims' families, and the investigation that led to the capture of the perpetrators. Number 5, False Flag. False Flag, is a psychological thriller and espionage drama, that gained international acclaim for its suspenseful plot, and intricate storytelling. False Flag was praised for its unique premise. It contributed to the recognition of Israeli television, as a source of high-quality drama and storytelling. The plot of False Flag revolves around a group of ordinary Israeli citizens, who wake up one morning to discover that their pictures have been used in an international media campaign, linking them to a high-profile assassination. 
The five individuals have no connection to the crime and are innocent. But they find themselves implicated as suspects in the assassination of a prominent Iranian nuclear scientist. Number 4, Tehran. Tehran is an espionage thriller series that first premiered in Israel and later became available internationally on Apple TV+. Tehran has garnered attention for its gripping narrative, suspenseful storytelling, and geopolitical themes. The series follows the story of Tamar Rabinian, an Israeli Mossad agent who goes undercover in Tehran, Iran. Tamar, played by Nin Sultan, is a talented computer hacker, who is sent to Iran on a dangerous mission. Her mission is to disable Iran's air defense systems, to pave the way for an Israeli airstrike on a nuclear facility in Tehran. As Tamar infiltrates Iranian society and the world of espionage, she faces numerous challenges and dangers. She must navigate a web of deception and betrayal, all while evading Iranian intelligence agencies and maintaining her cover as a flight attendant. Number 3, The Spy The Spy is a mini-series that premiered on Netflix. It is a political espionage thriller that is based on the real-life story of Eli Cohen, an Israeli spy who operated undercover in Syria in the 1960s. The spy follows the life and espionage activities of Eli Cohen. Portrayed by Sitchar Baron Cohen in a departure from his usual comedic roles. Eli Cohen is an Israeli Mossad agent, who is recruited to infiltrate the Syrian government, under the alias Kamala Amin Tarbait. He successfully integrates himself into Syrian high society, and becomes close to influential individuals, including key political figures and military officials. Number 2, Fahuda. The title Fahuda is an Arabic word that translates to chaos. The show revolves around the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, and is primarily set in the West Bank. It follows the lives of a group of Israeli undercover agents from the Mistawin unit, who are trained to operate within Palestinian territories, while disguised as Arabs. The agent's mission is to track down and capture or eliminate members of various Palestinian militant groups, including Hamas. The central character of the series is Doro Kowila, played by Lee or Raz, who is a retired Mistar Wim operative, brought back into service when it is discovered that a notorious Hamas fighter he thought he had eliminated years ago is still alive and active. This revelation sets off a complex and intense cat and mouse game between the Israeli agents and their Palestinian adversaries. Number 1 Prisoners of War Prisoner of War is a psychological drama that explores the experiences of Israeli soldiers who were held captive in Lebanon for 17 years and their reintegration into Israeli society upon their release. The series opens with the return of two Israeli soldiers, Nimrod Klein and Arizak, who were captured during a classified mission in Lebanon in 2000. They had been presumed dead, but are now released in a prisoner exchange with Hezbollah. Their return to Israel raises questions about their captivity, the circumstances of their release, and whether they may have been turned into enemy agents during their captivity. The success of Prisoner of War led to its adaptation into the American series Homeland, 